Hey, how's it going folks? E.T. here with another iMovie tutorial. Today's tutorial is importing media into iMovie. Let's go ahead and launch iMovie and get started. So this is a brand new version of iMovie. I haven't put any media into it whatsoever. There's no projects at all. So we're going to go ahead and actually create a new project. I'm going to go to Movie and now we have a new project. So when you want to actually import media, there's several ways to do it in iMovie. The first, first way you can actually do it is to click on this down arrow here and it's going to allow you to actually add media. It's going to prompt you with a pop-up window. You're going to go to the location to find your media. You're going to select it either one by one or you can use the shift key to hold down and select a bunch of it. And then you can hit import all. And what iMovie is going to do is actually import it. It's going to drop it into this my media sub tab here. Okay. So what we have here is we have a couple videos, a couple pictures, and one audio file. So that's one way to do it. Okay, the second way to import media is to use the file menu here. So go to File, go to Import Media. And what I did was I actually dropped a new image on my desktop here. It's an image of my car and my new wheels. And we're going to go ahead and Import Selected. So now we've imported that piece of media. And another way to do it, you can drag and drop it into your My Media area here or straight into the timeline. So let me go ahead and show you. We'll grab this one here. We'll drag it into the My Media. It's added. Or if you want to, you can just drag it straight into the timeline and it'll populate in the timeline. So let me go ahead and delete this real quick. Okay, so that's three ways to actually import media. Okay, and the last thing I want to show you, if you do have a camera, you got an SD card or anything like that, and it is on your desktop, it functions the same way as a hard drive would. You can either grab it by going into it and finding that piece of media then dragging it in or if you want to you can go through the import media here if you have the camera connected or if you're using a usb card reader or something like that you can actually see the media within the window itself here so you can grab that and import that part of it well i think that's pretty much every way you can import media remember you can just drag it straight into the timeline here you can drag it straight into the the my media area here or you can go through the drop down arrow here. You can go through the file import here, import media here. So those are the ways, pretty much any way you'll, you'll need to actually import. Alrighty, I wanna thank everybody for watching. And as usual, peace and aloha.